so this is our room. I already had a peek. Uh, this is what the bathroom looks like. There's this really cool, big, gigantic mirror here. It's really nice. The toilet and the shower. This is really cute. Well, we have two beds in this room. I think I didn't know how to book, but it's nice. We'll just snuggle into one small bed. And there's Gozi. <laughs> I like the decor. The purple is so pretty. This is really, really pretty. Oh, wow. Decorations are nice. TV. All of this is very nice. Don't know what else is on the other side of the trees. Wow, this is beautiful. Like you feel like you're in a rainforest. So right off the bat, this place reminds me of Morocco just because I saw palm trees right away and I got really excited and I was like, oh, just reminiscing and stuff. Uh, but it's humid, it's hot, really thick, but it's nice so far, it's really nice. We took um, a taxi here, it was kind of expensive. It was $70, that's how much it cost. And I don't think it was supposed to be that price, but it's okay. Um, Cause now we know, and now you know, if you decide to come to Florida, now you know. But um, yeah, so far so good. I love the room, it's really nice. And I'm just excited to do stuff now. So we'll see what we get into and I will take you along with us. I might have to change this camera cause I keep having to like get up close and personal and stuff. But yeah, I'm excited, we're finally here. I have a question for you guys. So, like I showed you in our mini room tour um, portion of this video, there are two beds. So the debate is, <laughs> do we sleep in separate beds? I mean, we're married and all. Or do we have to sleep in the same bed? I mean, there shouldn't be have tos, right? Pay for two beds? No, it was all the same price. That's how, why I didn't know it was a difference. I thought I paid for a deluxe, whatever, whatever. But we got two beds, and it's actually quite comfortable. But you see how I'm laying and how he's laying. You're not even taking advantage of the full bed right now. Oh, not yet. So that means that there's room for, okay, well. Not right now. <laughs> now he is. I mean, these beds are comfortable. I feel like this is like the comfiest bed I've been in in a really long time. It's just so plush. If you've been to Universal Studios, let us know in the comments below what your favorite thing to do here was, or is, if you come along. We're gonna eat a snack and then explore the park and see, not park, we don't get to go to the park actually until tomorrow. So if you're watching this today, tune in for the next video where you get to see us enjoying life and stuff at the park, slash giving you all tips and tricks and things like that as we learn and as we go along. Don't touch the water, it's eight bucks. It is? Yeah. Where is it? Don't even, you don't even need to know. Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, so where are we gonna get water from? Cause... We will not, we will drink our spits. <laughs> Sorry, we need to enjoy life. Okay. Wow, everything's already or, expensive when we just got yeah, here. Bath water, drink bath water. We could. Have you ever drank the tap water out of the... In their glasses? I've lived in luxury, but have not done that. You've never done that. Well, that's how I get my uh, fix. But I don't know what Florida water tastes like, so I might get sick. No offense to all of you Floridas slash Floridians. I want some of that. You want what? Some Butterfinger. That was not part of the options for you. So I'm gonna show you guys the snacks that I brought in this bag. And then I also have more snacks in my suitcase as well. Peanut butter packets, pretzels from the plane, these granola bars that I got, candy, cookies from the plane, trail mix, looks like this, pretzels, and I've got a big giant bag of pretzels in my suitcase, Apple Jacks, Cheerios, and Captain Crunch, so we have to find milk so we can go and um, yeah, enjoy ourselves. Gummy worms, gummy bears, sour bears, that's that. I like to bring my own snacks just so that I can maintain my own sugar and health levels and taste levels and things like that. And if things are really pricey or if like a shop is closed when I get hungry, 
I don't actually have to wait, so it's nice to have your own snacks. How are you liking the, the hotel grounds? It's big. There's a lot to, there's a lot to see, a lot to do. Yeah, a lot to do. And we're kind of matching today. Kind of. We uh, have our heart shirts on. Do you notice that? That's why I asked if you're why you were changing. Because I was trying not to be tough. Mine isn't hard though. It is a heart. It's the outline of the heart. See it on the camera? And it's a heart heartbreak. Yeah, we're twins. Yeah. Okay. Game room. Have you ever been in a photo booth before? I have never. Ready? He's being nosy. Trying to go into every room that there is here in the hotel. You pay to go into every room. Wow. Yeah. This is and pretty. Also it's still like honey. We got honey on the thing. We're not doing that. We're just looking, maybe. Somebody always has something to get out of her bag. Because she packed everything. Snacks. Memory card. Memory card. Lady stuff. Memory card. She packed everything. Yeah, it's intense. Yeah, yeah, it's raining, and I think that you're kind of. Oh, what are these big old brown bugs that look like wasps? Hurricane Florence. Don't say that. What? Don't jinx us. Oh, well, it's raining. <laughs> <laughs> Which is funny because Florence is my mom's. Name. I know. It is. <laughs> it is raining. Yeah, it's like for real raining. But I'm gonna have to put my camera away because it's actually like. Then it ran on my camera. Okay. You scared? Um. You're gonna get your map wet. Okay. Oh, that's good. Okay. Alright. You might have to find some cover. That's fantastic. Oh, yeah, it's fantastic. Feels good though. We're walking to. You see any crocodiles? Not yet, but if I fell in there, I'm yeah. dead. Yeah. Yeah. So the. Number one goal for this trip is for him to learn how to swim. So that if he falls into places like this, he won't feel like he's gonna die. I think he'll be fine. I think it's just your body will pull you down out of fear. No, it'll pull me down because I don't have any uh, water with like I don't I don't float like most people. Yes, you will float. Water. It's just no. if you're frantic, then you won't float. No, I go straight down. It's science. Mm. I go straight down because of muscle weight. Muscle weight, because you have a lot of muscle? Oh. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Now I feel it. We'll talk to you guys when we get to our destination, if we make it there. Universal over Disney for you is because we have a flair for the adult dramatic. So this is like right up your alley. But we'll be back tomorrow. Not today. Yeah.